Hello everyone, hope you all had a great holiday season. So today we are back with top 10 Android applications you should definitely check out. So without any further ado, let's roll that intro. Logo Foundry Logo Foundry is one of my favorite app. This app lets you create logos with preloaded shapes and fonts. You can share your logos and also check other logos from the community and download them. It's one of the most simple yet intricate ways to create your own logos for your own business ideas or your own company. The next one in the list is called YouTube Go. Now YouTube Go is a data friendly version of YouTube. Everyone likes YouTube one way or the other. So just imagine yourself in a long flight or you're traveling a lot. Now that's where you cannot keep on using your data. For this purpose, you have to use YouTube Go. Instead of buffering your videos online, you can download your videos and watch it whenever you want. The video is helpful to the folks who use mobile data to watch YouTube. Journey. It is an app used to store memories with photos and locations. Now, if you're a traveler and would love to keep everything integrated, such as your photos, your personal own diary or your certain notes, then consider getting this app. Also, you can think of this application as your own personal diary in which you can daily update yourself. So it's really useful for some travel vloggers. The next app on the list is called AnyDo. This app lets you create customized reminders and to-do lists. The reason I prefer this over the traditional system is because it supports cross-platform capabilities. Also, it syncs your calendars and to-do lists to all of your devices. Now, this is a bit better than the traditional Android system because even if you have a PC or a web, you can directly access it from there. Personally, one of my favorite app because this app just provides you with wallpapers, but you heard me wrong. It's not just wallpapers. There's something more to this app. The beauty of it is that the wallpaper matches the actual time of the day. Suppose if the sun sets in, the wallpaper starts to dim. So I think you get the idea. The app is also really battery friendly and the great, great advantage of this is that there are no ads. Space. Now guys, if you're like me, who's like completely addicted to your phone, but at the same time you want to spend more time with your family and friends, then you should definitely consider getting this application. Now what this app can do is that you can set your daily mobile usage and track your phone usage, such as how many times did you unlock your phone or how many times are you continuously using your phone, these kinds of things. Push bullet. Push Bullet is an interesting app. It lets you send files, images, text across your connected devices. Features for notification memory which lets you access mobile notifications from your laptop. Malwarebyte. Now guys, in 2018, security is a major concern for any smartphone. So considering all those factors, what we have come up with is the best free antivirus app for Android. This app protects you from any kind of malware and notifies you for threat in any of the other apps. Consider definitely getting this. Usician. Now guys, it's 2018 and everyone has their new year's resolution. Now if your resolution happens to be to learn a musical instrument, then consider getting yourself this application. It has a simple and an elegant user interface. Apart from that, with an inbuilt microphone, you can play your instrument and the app will provide you with a feedback such as the accuracy and the score. And also, it will provide a step-by-step -step tutorial for some certain songs and white soundtrack. Android Auto. Guys, this app is a must. Especially if you're a driver, you should definitely consider getting this app because it's going to bring all the primitive features of a phone let's say such as uh, calling someone, texting someone or choosing a different kind of music and these days it's very important that you keep your eyes on the road and be safe 
uh, it's gonna use uh, some of the OK Google features such as for navigation, music and calling. So that's it for this video guys. I really hope you liked it. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up, comment down below and subscribe to our channel. And let us know which of this was your favorite app.